Tuesday. You know what that means? Tom's got the know-how. He's on your screen. Quick little tricks. Smart ideas that stick. It's Tuesday Tips with Tom. Members frequently ask, what type of oil should I use in my airplane? There are three types of engine oil, natural, synthetic or man-made oils, and semi-synthetics, a mixture of the two. Oil can be either straight weight or multi-viscosity. Viscosity relates to slickness or how well an oil lubricates. Viscosity varies with temperature. A straight weight oil is optimized either for winter temperatures, providing better oil flow for cold weather starts, or for warmer seasons. A lower number is for colder temperatures. A Rochelle W80, for example, is designed for minus 17 to plus 21 degrees Celsius. B100 is best at 15 to 30 degrees Celsius. Some owners use straight weight oils and change them seasonally. A multi-viscosity oil is blended to have a good viscosity across a range of temperatures. Philips 20W50, for example, has the viscosity of an SAE20 oil in winter. That's what the W was for, and an SAE50 oil in summer. If you fly between warm and cold locations, you might want to use a multi-viscosity oil. Some engine builders recommend using straightway oil for engine break-in, while others suggest a multi-viscosity oil is fine too. Follow the recommendation of the engine builder you use. The most recent pilot's operating handbook for Bonanzas for the G36 includes a note in the limitations section referencing a Continental Motor specification. It points to a list of oils that meet Continental specifications at the time the POH was written and says any other oil meeting that specification may also be used. Continental's M-0 manual says to use an SAE 50 oil or multi-viscosity above 40 degrees Fahrenheit and an SAE 30 or multi-viscosity oil in colder temperatures. It includes a list of currently available products meeting Continental standard. ABS's technical advisors report a correlation between using Aeroshell 15W50 and an early failure of starter adapters. Their theory is that this oil is so slick, the starter does not stop spinning as quickly after engine start, causing excessive wear. This observation is correlation, not causation, but the technical advisors suggest using some other oil to protect your starter. There you have it. Any aviation oil meeting these recommendations is approved for use in your engine. I'm Tom Turner. Thanks for taking two minutes to learn even more about your Beechcraft.